All right, guys, I just got back home. I've been uh, getting a stream full of messages, so I pretty much knew what had actually occurred. And sad to hear that uh, Matt Porter had passed away. Uh, you know, I hadn't spoken with him in over a year and a half. We had gotten into a uh, what I would consider a serious discussion about things, which, you know, I'm not going to touch base on that at this present time. Uh you know, some of you guys are going to go and claim that the, you were friends with him just because you're linked on Facebook. You know, I'm linked with them on Facebook as well. You know, I've known them for a bunch of years, but that doesn't mean that you're close friends or even acquaintances. You know, so, you know, I'll leave that up to some of these YouTubers that are trying to, you know, make a fast buck to go and claim their friends. The truth of the matter is, you know, Matt Porter actually had a select circle of friends uh, and it was a very small number of them, you know, and I wasn't one of them. Uh, but all the same, you know, uh, I read what uh, Rachel wrote and I wasn't aware that he was having some pneumonia like issues a couple of weeks ago. Not sure if that played a part or anything like that. But, you know, at the same time, and it's like I always say, Regardless as to what happened, this is the end of this man's life. His legacy has now been written. And I'm just going to ask everyone, regardless as whether you were friends with Matt Porter, whether you were foes with Matt Porter, whether you just didn't like him or not, you know, give the family some time to grief. You know, Matt just actually had a kid not too long ago. And there's going to be a lot of speculation and stuff like that. Some of these YouTubers are going to try to cash in on the passing of Matt Porter, you know, in order to make a little bit of extra cash. I'm going to run his autopsy report, going to do a whole bunch of shit like that, you know. I'm simply not going to play a part in that there, regardless as to how I felt about Matt Porter. Like I said, wasn't his friend, was an acquaintance of him, or not even so much of as an acquaintance. Like I said, the last conversation I had with Matt Porter didn't go over so well. But at the same time, you know, still a brother in iron, you know, a fellow bodybuilder. We got to pay some respect for that. And I hope you grant his wife, Rachel, a little bit of respect, give her time to mourn, not put out any of this goofy bullshit that typically happens when uh, stuff like this happens. But that's all I got to say on the subject. You guys have a good night.